Ugh, this rain is so annoying. You're so annoying. Yeah, well, I hope it ends soon. I hope you end soon. Ugh, I'm getting soaked. You're getting soaked. Uh, and you're ugly as well. As ever, Ed, your sense of humor never ceases to amaze me. Was that an insult? You figure it out. Finally, after many years, I return. Now it's time to... Wait. That was an insult. When they found the skeleton in my kitchen, they assumed it was mine, so by the time I got home, the landlord had already rented the place out for someone else. So that's when I called you. Hey guys, do you see a sinister looking guy down the alleyway? Whoa, yeah. Oh, that is sinister. Oh wait, I meant that alleyway. Kind of looked like Ed with a beard. Don't be silly, only Tom can grow a beard. I have a disorder! So there's no way it could be me. Or is it? No, there isn't. Oh, wait, maybe. I am you from the far off year of 2000 and where cola has been outlawed as a drug all over the globe. After several years, I realized there was only one choice. I had to travel into the past to... Kill my past self to spare me from such a grim future! But that doesn't look very futuristic. I wanted my chicken extra crispy! This changes nothing! Excuse me, I have extremely important business to attend to and I- ah, What cruel irony! Such a nice young man. Oh no, a giant laser! Help me, super guy! Nothing to fear. With my powers, I can stop anything in the world. Just as long as it isn't lasers. <laughs> Grab what you need and let's get out of here. Baby, I've missed you. Passport, nope. Medicine, nope. Price of heirlooms, nope. Aha! My lucky can. Matt, come on, we have to go. Okay, I'm on my way. Sorry, guys. You'll be in my heart. Aww. <laughs> Right, time for Operation Mega Escape 4. <laughs> Open. Access. Enter. Broccoli. Hey, head. Alright guys, so it was the pasta for you, the tacos for you, and for you? 
Whatever you want, sweet cheek. Uh, I'll just have a meat and potato pie. All right, and would anyone like any drinks? Oh, uh, we'll just have one, two. Y yeah, better make it two gallons of coke, please. So why exactly are we all running away from this guy if he only wants to kill Ed? Hey! Well, without Ed, it would just be me and you, and, well, that would suck. Has anyone else noticed this is, like, the most we've ever spoken? Hey, Ed. Holy pug in a pizza box! Blah, 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 blah. What made you think your future self would not know where his past self would be hiding? What? Then how come it took you so long to find us? Shut up! Now prepare to die! Wait, how do we know you're actually Ed from the future? Well, a lucky can, Ed. I remember exactly how we got it. La 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 Ooh, a can! Shove! La 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 He's right! Now that's out of the way, prepare to die! But, but, won't this make some kind of paradox or something? Don't be stupid. That kind of thing only happens in the movies. In the movies. 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 Son of a <laughs> Hmm, this is gonna be harder than I thought. Looks like I'll need some reinforcements. Excuse me, but do you know where the- Oh my god, he bit off his arm! Run away! Whoops, looks like I undershot it a bit. Uh -huh. Help me. Oh, I wouldn't, Matt, but uh, you know, timelines and paradoxes and stuff. Meanwhile... Huh, it's a good job Red Leader had a second time travel device. Now we just have to stop Ed before he messes anything up in the future. Oh, he's a dead man. So where should we start looking? I'm not sure, but I hope Ed's past self has enough sense to hide somewhere. <laughs> I'm distracted. Who keeps buying this stuff? Yeah. We should probably get back to the cars now. Time to finish this once and for all with my army of me's Edens. Sir Ed, Edius, and Edgar. So now there's no escape. Attack my brother! <coughs> How can this plan get any worse? Stop right there! Oh god, I'm old! Hey, uh, why the eye thing? Remember that laser you took to the face? Uh, yeah? Cancer. Anyway, Ed, we're here to stop you before you destroy the future for your selfish needs. No! I won't go back! I won't go back to that bleak, soda-free future! No, Susan! Matt, hurry, save us!
Today we have the pleasure of speaking to the well-known creator, author, founder and king of pretty much everything in existence since the dawn of man, known simply as Matt. Tell us, Matt, how did you come up with the idea of creating and ruling everything in existence? Well, it all started when I got my hands on it. I mean, uh, invented my own time machine. Anyway, I pretty much just went back in time and did all the... I hate... Love, Matt!